Security is always a concern for New Year's Eve in Times Square. And this year, thousands of officers are on patrol and they're using a new tool to keep revelers safe, drones. Eva Pilgrim is outside with all the details. Eva, good morning to you. Good morning. Well, yeah, we're used to seeing a police presence here on the ground, but this year we're actually going to see a presence from the sky in the form of drones for the first time. And the countdown is on. I just want to show you what's going on here. You can already feel and see the excitement building. The stages are up. The barricades are built. And if you look, you can see people are already gathering here, getting ready to get in line so they can be a part of the festivities. Hundreds of thousands of people are expected to pile in to get as close to Times Square as possible so they can see that iconic ball drop. Now some law enforcement already in place, more coming. Thousands of officers both in uniforms and plain clothes will be in this area. And this area is closed to traffic at this time. Everyone coming in will be screened and there will be a long list of things you can't bring to this area. No backpacks, umbrellas or booze. And if you leave because it's going to be so tight and so crowded here, there is no getting back in with a lot of rules that are even and for all the brave souls who will be locked in there in Times Square. What's new from the tech angle? Well, this year for the first time, you're actually able to text the words New Year's Eve to 692692 to get updates about weather conditions, traffic, traffic delays, and more. The one thing it won't be able to tell you with, where's the bathroom? Because there's not one in the barricades. These people will all be holding it. I don't know how they do that every year. Try to figure that one out. Eva Pilgrim for us. Thanks so much. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.